This is a safe, sanitary experience. Fun too, fun as well. Make it as fun as it can be, but it's got to be safe and sanitary. The Gardens Casino and other casinos across LA County welcomed back players today for the first time in nearly seven months after shutting down because of the pandemic. Under the card room guidelines issued by the state, casinos can reopen with outdoor operations only. You uh, see a subfloor, carpet, chairs, tables, trust work with cameras, air conditioning. So we've, we've basically tried to replicate the indoor experience outdoors. But there are several changes to keep players and casino employees safe. At the Gardens Casino, in addition to mandatory face coverings, there are temperature checks and questions about symptoms before players enter. And you must have a player's card that is scanned to know you were here today in case we have to ever do contact tracing. We'll know you were here. Do you have a player's card? Commonly touched areas are constantly wiped down. At the table, there's now plexiglass between players as well as the dealer. Under the new rules, food or beverage service is not allowed, so the Gardens Casino made a separate area for that and brought in outdoor restroom accommodations. Uh, I've been playing here for about 20 years, and um, I'm excited that they reopened today, so here I am to celebrate with them. Jason Trulove is happy to be back, but he says it doesn't feel the same. The amount of people that are allowed to sit at the table, um, there's only three, um, as, as, for, as there's usually about eight, um, and, and then waiting to get in. Um, it's just the whole, the whole thing's a little bit slower. Despite the changes, Trulove says what's most important is that some people have their jobs back and there's more money for the city. Casino officials say Hawaiian Gardens derives 74% of its budget from them. We are so happy to have our employees back, many of them, our customers, our loyal customers back, and to be able to provide revenue for this city, which so sorely uh, needs it at this time. I'm glad that they're in business and I'm glad for the city. Reporting in Hawaiian Gardens, Rachel Kim, KCAL 9 News.